Earlier today, the College of Charleston Center for the Study of Slavery unveiled a new historical marker recognizing the dark history of the slave trade in Charleston. News 2's Delilah James spoke with officials about the meaning of the piece and what it will bring to the community. During your next stroll near downtown Charleston, you might notice a new landmark along Broad Street. It's a marker dedicated to remember the thousands of enslaved people who were sold during the 1800s. An emotional ceremony recalling a difficult time in Charleston's history. Um, I'm from Charleston. I walk this street consistently. My offices are 100 yards away. Uh, and without these stories being told, our history is left behind. Uh, gaps were bridged today. Um, so I'm standing for my ancestors. Um, but we will leverage that and build an opportunity for a just and profitable future. 24 Broad Street was home to a firm that handled the largest sale of enslaved African American people in the United States history. And while locals and tourists alike come to admire the beauty of the holy city, it's important to acknowledge the darker side of our past and to learn from it. A metallic marker that tells an unknown story about this building. And while people are reading it, they will learn something about an important chapter in the history of slavery and the history of America and the history of Charleston. The marker honoring the countless people who were sold and whose identities were taken, a spot for their descendants to connect with their history and pay tribute to their ancestors. We are finally talking about what we never knew. So my hope for other generations is that they won't lose their history, that they will understand it and it will help us all be stronger. Officials are welcoming the public to view the new marker on 24th Broad Street. And for more details, to please visit charleston.edu. Reporting in downtown Charleston, I'm Delilah James, Count 1-2.